let's try this again. Okay, I think this might actually work this time. So let me see if I can full screen this. That would be phenomenal here. Stupid logo. in like a weird bot on the screen. I'm gonna go out of full screen. Alright, let's start a new game here. And this is Conker's Bad Fur Day, so uh I don't know if this game could necessarily be made today, uh, but it is definitely something I've been wanting to stream for a while, just because it's that good of a game. It was made in 2001. Um, it did not sell well for the time because it's a mature game disguised. It's like a parody of a, of a children's platformer. the king, king of all the land. Who'd have thought that? But how did I come to this, I hear you say? And who are those strange fellows that surround my throne? I hear you also say. Well, it's a long story. Come closer, and I'll tell you. It all started yesterday. And what a day that was. It's what I call a bad fur day. To some, I don't know, fight some war somewhere. Anyway, um, that excuse, right? I'll see ya. 
By the way, if you hadn't figured it out, the same guy voicing the uh, the Panther King, the little weasel guys, Conker, it's all the same dude. It's Chris Sieber, the lead developer of this game. Oh no, he's pissed. Playing with a keyboard, by the way, so it's gonna control really, really hard. You can do some like sad little jump, that's cool. What is up, Neil? Oh, hello, yeah. hello. Oh, hello. Can you help me? Ugh. Ugh. I, I need to get home and go to bed because I don't feel very well at all. <laughs> oh, no. No. Oh, so you can't help me at all? Uh, uh, actually, yeah. Uh, yes, I can. Maybe. Um, okay. What's your name? Really? 
Beardy? You haven't got a beard. No. Randy. I scared Birdies. Oh, hey, Birdie. Um, so how you, can you help me? Right. Let's uh, step over here. Okay, we'll step over here. See those buttons? Actually, you'll find that uh, uh, they could contact sensitive. <laughs> and, uh, uh, well, actually, they uh, uh, pressed B. Press B. Oh, yeah. The light comes on. Uh, and it makes this nice ting. Right, uh, ting noise. Nice ting. Uh, no, ting. That's it. That's it? Yeah. Okay, I'll press B. This is one of like the first games to have like full like facial Ooh. animations, not uh, just like brand. <laughs> hey, that was my beard, dude. Uh, what does that mean? It means contact sensitive. It's sensitive to context. Try over there. That is what that would mean. That was okay. context sensitive. Oh, you could try it again. Context. Before I do that, let's see if I can make the window a little bigger too. Because I know if I full screen, it's going to get all weird. I could probably make this even bigger. Let's see. Oh, look at that. That's nice. Oh. Oh, just what I needed. In fact, it would seem to me that these give me just what I need at that moment in time. Wouldn't it be nice if something like that in real oh, life existed? I see what he means. Context sensitive. Clever. Oh, I feel a little better. Right, let's get out of here. Oh, and by the way, if for whatever reason you want to skip all these wonderful cutscenes, then just press the L button. But you will have to have watched them at least once. Alright, now I'm actually controlling it at full speed. So bear with me guys, this is gonna be my control this might be a little bit of a, a little bit of a thing. Oh. I can't seem to get any further. I'm sure there was something. Ah yeah, now I remember. Hold the Z button down. And I should crap. Now then, what was it? Oh yeah, press A to jump extra high. Then A again to do that funny helicopter tail thing. Funny and that helicopter makes me thing. Hmm. That's what the movie is I should easily get a crap at that guy. Ladies and gentlemen, the funny helicopter tail thing. Um, are you sure you got that? Let me make you uh, make sure. This is going to be very awkward with me using the, uh, the Well, oh, oh, oh. oh, I almost had it. This is pretty difficult to maneuver using the uh, key. I don't think this is made to be played with the keyboard, to be honest. Now, I think I was asking before. I think they make, like, a gadget that lets you, uh... Well, like a 64 controller into like a USB, like a 64 to USB. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> Somebody should just beam all these, all these fails here. How when you come back into this room, the camera flips around like you're ready to like go into the other room there, you know? Alright, there we go. Get in the 
hang of the keys. Charm. I just want to get past, please. No, I don't think so. I've only just got comfy. Have you ever sat on a piece of Gothic architecture for 200 years? <laughs> Gets right up your ass, you know. Thought it was about time to move on to a bridge, say. And I'm not moving now. Isn't it a little bit early in the day to start talking about Gothic architecture? Well... If you care to come a bit closer, we can discuss things of another nature. No, I think I'm good. So, I used to, I thought that for some reason when I was younger, I thought that was really funny. Um, with the uh, gargoyle. It's right up your ass, dude. really these angles uh, that do it, you know. B and see what that does. I think this is where we get the front. Um, are you sure you've got that? It's my butt. Oh, yeah, that's the front. Now, this should be fun to do with the keys. I landed by the door. The cloud has a silver lining, right?
I'm already telling you right now, like, the levels that have, like, precise aiming, that's gonna be very interesting. Definitely gonna be very interesting to play with the keyboard. We all, uh... If I can get that device to uh, convert the controller to the USB, I mean, I'll definitely do it. I will say that they did a good job with the uh, distance fog. This was apparently the first game that did not have distance fog. So. Notice when I come up with that safe state idea, now I'm actually able to, uh, to actually play it. The frying pan. 
You <laughs> stupid little... Oh, look, the guy's over here. He's dead. Fine, I just want to complete... Okay, I think, like, uh, I just gotta go up there, and then the training level is basically done. I gotta say, this has been pretty fun. Oh, yeah, I'm like another thing. Hard to play. Why did they do that? I must be like pressing it. I don't even realize. Because to make like uh, certain directions, you have to basically hit like the like the key on two different ones. Here I was thinking I was getting better at playing the keyboard too. Yeah. <sighs> 
it's getting there, guys. This is gonna be probably like the hardest part of this is learning to uh, play this with the keyboard. Some shut eye. Finally. here. I think I see the problem. I will see what I can do. She must give me a moment, though. <laughs> I'll come back later. Don't be too low. Uh, I'll be as quick as I can, sir. Because you know what happened last time. <laughs> On it a while. On it a while. I I'll go now. I don't want to have to get the duct tape out again. Oh, my God. Uh, uh, yes. Wait, no. Andre, I don't want you to get the duct tape out again. Uh, goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, rare wear. Duct tape? I'll get him a duct tape. <laughs> asshole. I'll come down here. I'll show him what the duct tape is. I'll show him what the stuff is. Stupid. <laughs> all I do all day is trying to sort his stupid <laughs> problems out of the asshole. I'm f***ing <laughs> Anyway. What are we? Um, the milk, the milk, the table, the table, the table. What shall we do? What shall we Rodents do with this? of the world. Um, clean slate. Yeah, clean slate. Uh, this, uh, anti gravity chocolate so is kind of working. Uh, that's what we'll do. That's what we'll do. At the f window with that. Now, see this level right here, so this is like the hub world. 
<laughs> I love how it's still. Listen to like the music, just like a parody of like any like platforming game here. Okay, that's how you look around. It's the best button, it looks like. Oh, it's inverted. I hope she's rich because she needs to. <laughs> what do you want me to do about it? Please get it back for us. Otherwise, I don't know what we're going to do. <laughs> okay, okay, calm down. I'll go and get it for you. Now, where is it? Oh, just follow the signs. <laughs> oh, what, what I wanted to do. Alright, we gotta go get the beehive back. And I, I remember this leads to a pretty funny cutscene. Let's see how well I'm gonna be able to do this keyboard. Trying to steal our nice new house. <laughs> their, their voices. Come on, let's go get it. Yeah, yeah, let's get him. Let's get him. Why are you? I'm gonna steal your I'll get him. How I'm doing this with the keys, I have no idea. I cannot let like, go off that path. I love this part. <laughs> um. Eat lead, mother buzzer. Eat lead, mother buzzer, he said. That no good husband of mine has gone off, you know, with another woman. Oh, really? That doesn't surprise me. <laughs> what? I love coming from a little sarcastic anyway, as little as a reward uh, for your good there. service to the bee community, I present you with this. Hope I've Come done good service to the bee community. This game is like, you know, it was a, uh, this was like the collect uh, the collectathon era of uh, Rare, right? So, and uh, look, the money still falls out of your pocket as you go. Alright, who's this? But yeah, instead of collecting like useless trinkets, you just collect a little hard cash. They were kind of parodying themselves. Pretty meta. Anyway, I'm gonna. Save state here, and uh, I think I'm gonna end the stream here. Just, uh, you know, playing with this keyboard is a little annoying, but definitely gonna stream this more because uh, I definitely want to show you guys this game. I freaking love this game. Uh, but that's just a little preview of what we're gonna see thus far. And um, yeah, getting a little used to uh, streaming with OBS now. So, oh, you pick the can. I remember that game, pick the can. Anyway. I'm going to call it a day, so have a good one, everyone.